Ben Shapiro totally embarrasses left-wing activist on critical race theory. Critical race theory is becoming a hot-button issue throughout America. Governors are banning the teachings. School boards are going off the rails on defense and left-wing activists are trying hard to defend them. Ben Shapiro is bringing them back to reality, though. Watch him totally embarrass one pro-CRT activist in this video. Ben, I think you wanted to make a couple comments. Yeah, I mean, this will be a very quick note. I mean, I obviously disagree with you about critical race theory and whether it is taught in the public schools. Critical race theory, which I studied in law school, it started off as a legal theory, but it has an element of praxis and practice uh, that was meant to be implemented, which is why it is taught in education schools as well, and why... In elementary a very, schools? Yes, though? a very boiled down... I mean, Ibram X. Kendi is, is preaching a very boiled down version of critical race theory, and his book is assigned in elementary schools. I mean, the fact is that when you are having elementary school students who are having to check off boxes with regard to their race and then explain to each other whether they are historically privileged or not in fourth or fifth grade, that's, that's a very dumbed down version of critical race theory. There's sort of a game that gets played with regard to legal theories that end up being boiled down. Intersectionality is another great example of this. Kimberly Crenshaw writes a very intelligent law review article about intersectionality and how you can be a member of more than one minority group and be discriminated against in a variety of ways. And then that is used as the basis for a much broader move in American political life. And then as soon as you point that out, they say, well, that's not intersectionality. It's the original law review article. That's, that's a bit of no true Scotsman games playing. And so I, I, I object to that. And, and I'm, look, it is a relevant issue when you have Terry McAuliffe, who's running for governor of Virginia, literally saying in open debate that it should not be parents who are making the educational decisions for their children. It should be the people in education. I mean, that, that, that is a culture war issue that I think is of key importance to people who have kids, right?